Hi, welcome to the channel NCRT Maths Tutor. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Also, click the bell icon to get regular notification. In this video, I am explaining about different forms of general equation ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 in that intercept form. See, generally, before understanding this concept, please refer the previous videos of the concept intercept form. Already we know that intercept form we can represent by using the equation x divided by a plus y divided by b is equal to 1. Here, a and b a is the x-intercept and b is the y-intercept. So now, in this intercept form, we have to represent this particular general equation. So we have the equation ax plus by plus c is equal to 0. So this c I am taking to the right hand side. So we have ax plus by is equal to minus c. Now we have to represent this equation in this form. So divide both sides by minus c. So that here we will get here 1. So, ax divided by minus c plus by divided by minus c is equal to minus c divided by minus c. So, here we have ax divided by minus c plus by divided by minus c is equal to 1. Now, this we can write as, we have here ax divided by minus c, this we can write as x divided by minus c by a. In the same way, plus y divided by minus c by b is equal to 1. Now, compare this value with this particular equation. You can see that here, we can take a value as minus c by a and the b value as minus c by b. So, this is nothing but our x-intercept and this is nothing but y-intercept. So, using the equation of intercept form, we can reduce the general equation ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 in this way where we can find out the x-intercept as minus c by a and y-intercept as minus c by b. Now, let us see how we can use these type of uh, equations in the problem. See, I have taken one example here, 3x minus 4y plus 10 is equal to 0. Let us see that this equation is given to you and you need to find out the x-intercept and y-intercept of this equation. So, to find out that, first represent this equation in the form that is x divided by a plus y divided by b is equal to 1. So, you need to represent this equation in intercept form. So, Take this 10 to the right hand side. So, we have here 3x minus 4y is equal to minus 10. Now, divide both sides by minus 10. So, 3x divided by minus 10 minus 4y divided by minus 10 is equal to minus 10 divided by minus 10. That is 3x divided by minus 10 plus 4y divided by 10 is equal to 1. Now, we can write this one as x divided by minus 10 by 3 plus y divided by 10 by 4 is equal to 1. Now, we have here x divided by minus 10 by 3 plus 2 2 sir and 2 5 sir y divided by 5 by 2 is equal to 1. Now compare this particular value with the equation x divided by a plus y divided by b is equal to 1. From this we can say that a is equal to minus 10 by 3 that is the x intercept and b is equal to 5 by 2 that is the y intercept. So like this way we can find out the value or you can directly use the formula here. See this particular equation if you compare with the general equation ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 then here we can take a as 3 and b as minus 4 and c value as 10. Now here from this intercept form we know that x intercept we can find out by using the formula minus c divided by a. So here c value is 10 minus t, c divided by a means minus 10 divided by here we have the value 3 so minus 10 divided by 3. So this forms the x intercept. Then for y intercept we have the formula that is b is equal to minus c that is minus 10 divided by b. b value is here minus 4. So that is 2, 2, sir, 2, 5, sir. So we can have here y intercept as pi by 2. So by using this formula directly we can find out the value if equation is given to you or you can bring this particular equation in the intercept form then also you can find the value. So there are two ways whichever method is convenient to you that method method you can apply. Thanks for watching.